By 2026, the world won't be transformed by one breakthrough, it'll be shaped by many converging at once. In this video, we're breaking down the 20 tech trends that experts say will rule 2026 and redefine how we live, work, and interact. Let's dive in. Number 20, Agentic AI. Unlike chatbots that wait for prompts, agentic AI can plan, adapt, and act autonomously. OpenAI, Google, and Anthropic are piloting these systems to complete multi-step workflows. By 2026, logistics, healthcare, and finance could rely on AI agents that not only generate outputs, but make decisions, coordinate tasks, and even determine when to involve humans. In fact, McKinsey estimates that automation powered by AI AI could impact work on activities across 60 to 70 percent of current jobs. It's less about replacing people and more about AI taking on the messy, in-between steps humans often don't have time for. Number 19. Bioprinting and Quantum Computing Bioprinting is moving toward clinical trials with 3D printed skin and organ tissues. At the same time, quantum computing hit milestones with IBM's 1,121 qubit condor chip and Google's advances in quantum algorithms. By 2026, bioprinting could aid drug testing, while quantum computing begins solving optimization and material science challenges that classical computers can't touch. Global data projects the 3 the bioprinting market will surpass $4 billion by 2027, showing how fast this field is growing. When you pair that with Quantum's momentum, you got two frontiers racing ahead in parallel. Number 18. AI-Driven Energy Systems AI workloads are pushing energy demand to new highs. The International Energy Agency projects data center electricity use could double by 2026. To counter this, DeepMind has already cut Google's cooling costs by 40% using AI. Grid operators are adopting machine learning to balance renewables, predict demand, and manage batteries. AI is becoming essential to sustaining AI itself. Number 17. Physical AI Robots are moving beyond repetition into adaptive tasks. Tesla's Optimus was shown fold and close in 2024, while Japan piloted service robots in elder care. John Deere tractors now use AI vision to farm autonomously. By 2026, expect physical AI in factories, hospitals, and logistics hubs. Handling work earlier robots could not manage. The global robotics market is projected to reach over $200 billion by 2030, according to Statista. And that growth is being fueled by AI giving machines the ability to think on the move. Number 16. Synthetic Biology plus AI AI is accelerating biology. DeepMind's AlphaFold predicted protein structures with remarkable accuracy, leading to new drug discovery pipelines. Isomorphic Labs partnered with major pharmaceutical firms in 2024 to speed up drug development. By 2026, synthetic biology will extend into agriculture and materials, with AI-designed enzymes already being tested for biodegradable plastics and sustainable food production. Number 15. Sovereign AI Nations are building their own AI models to keep control over data and infrastructure. France launched Mistral, an EU-backed open-source model, while Saudi Arabia and the UAE created sovereign AI funds. By 2026, localized AI systems will be central to geopolitics, ensuring governments reduce reliance on US or Chinese platforms while pushing for digital independence. The EU alone has committed billions of euros to to AI development under its Digital Europe program. And this push shows how AI is no longer just technology. It's a matter of national strategy. Number 14, Extended Reality, XR. AR and VR are moving beyond gaming. Walmart has trained over a million employees with VR, while companies like Meta and Apple push mixed reality headsets for work and entertainment. By 2026, XR could become mainstream in classrooms, remote training, and retail, where virtual stores let customers try products digitally. It's less about escaping reality and more about blending the physical and digital for everyday use. Number 13. AI-Powered Autonomous Robots 
Robots are leaving controlled environments and entering public spaces. Amazon's Scout delivery bot has been tested for last mile logistics, while Starship Technologies already operates delivery fleets across U.S. college campuses. In 2024, Seoul introduced autonomous cleaning robots in subway stations. By 2026, expect more service robots in warehouses, restaurants, and city streets, powered by better mapping, vision, and AI design decision making. Number 12. Smart Infrastructure and IoT 2.0 the number of IoT devices is projected to exceed 30 billion by 2030, with billions already online today. Cities like Singapore and Barcelona are embedding sensors to monitor traffic, pollution, and utilities in real time. By 2026, IoT 2.0 will move from basic smart gadgets to fully adaptive environments, with infrastructure that can adjust instantly to conditions, saving costs and improving safety. Statista reports that global IoT spending could hit $1.6 trillion by 2025. And that kind of investment shows how deeply connected systems are becoming part of everyday life. Number 11. AI Native Infrastructure Data centers are being rebuilt for AI. NVIDIA's GPUs dominate, but startups like Cerebrus and GraphCore are creating chips specialized for large models. Cloud providers are shifting to AI-optimized storage and networking. By 2026, AI-native will mean hardware, software, and energy systems designed around machine learning from the ground up not retrofitted for it. This change is invisible to consumers, but critical to scaling AI. Number 10. Cobots and Polyfunctional Robots Collaborative robots, or cobots, are designed to work alongside humans instead of replacing them. In 2024, Universal Robots passed 75,000 cobot installations worldwide, used in industries like packaging, assembly, and even food service. By 2026, expect polyfunctional robots capable of switching tasks quickly, from factory work to assisting in healthcare, making automation more flexible than traditional robots. Number 9. Privacy First AI with growing concerns over data leaks, on-device AI is gaining traction. Apple already runs parts of its generative AI locally on iPhones, and Qualcomm has built smart chips optimized for AI tasks without sending data to the cloud. By 2026, privacy-first AI could become standard for mobile, health, and personal assistance, giving users faster responses and more control over their data. Number 8. Vertical AI Agents Instead of general-purpose AI, industries are turning to domain-specific agents. In 2024, companies began piloting medical AI assistants trained on clinical data, while financial services tested compliance-focused co-pilots. By 2026, vertical AI agents could become standard in logistics, retail, and law, built to handle specialized knowledge and regulations that generic models can't manage effectively. Number 7. AI Agents in Everyday Tools AI is quietly making its way into everyday apps. Microsoft Office now comes with Copilot, Adobe Photoshop introduced Generative Fill, and Google Workspace uses AI to help with documents. By 2026, most productivity and creative tools may have AI built in as a standard feature instead of something extra. That means tools will start anticipating what you need rather than sitting idle and waiting for commands. Number 6. Brain Control Interfaces BCI. BCIs are moving from labs to real-world trials. I can talk to you with my thoughts. In 2024, Neuralink received FDA approval for human studies, and Synchron implanted brain interfaces in U.S. patients to help restore mobility. By 2026, BCIs may expand from medical applications to early consumer pilots, like gaming or communication tools. They won't be mainstream yet, but progress is steady, with growing interest in both clinical recovery and human-computer interaction. Number 5. AI Native Operating Systems 
Traditional operating systems are being reimagined. Instead of apps and menus, AI-first OS platforms will center around natural language interaction and automated workflows. Early signs are visible in Microsoft's AI Copilot integrated across Windows and Office, as well as experimental projects like Rabbit R1's natural language interface. By 2026, AI-native OS designs could shape how devices, from laptops to cars, function at their core. Number 4. Hybrid IT and Cloud Repatriation Companies are rethinking cloud use. Rising costs and security concerns are driving workloads back from public cloud to private or hybrid setups. A 2024 survey by 451 Research found over 50% of enterprises moving some workloads on-premise. By 2026, cloud repatriation and hybrid IT will be standard, blending edge, private, and public resources for better control, efficiency, and cost management management across industries. Number 3. AI-Powered Automation in Next-Gen Workflows AI isn't just automating single tasks anymore. It's starting to run entire workflows. McKinsey reported in 2023 that generative AI could add up to $4.4 trillion annually to the global economy, largely through workflow automation. By 2026, businesses could use AI to automate legal contracts, medical records processing, or supply chain management, creating faster, cheaper, and more efficient operations across sectors. Number 2. Edge Computing in 6G Edge computing reduces latency by processing data closer to where it's generated. Telecom companies are already rolling out 5G edge services, while 6G research is underway in countries like South Korea, Japan, and Finland. By 2026, edge computing will power real-time industrial IoT, while 6G trials could enable ultra-fast, low-latency applications for AR, robotics, and autonomous vehicles. Together, they'll redefine Fine network speed and reliability. Number 1. Digital Identity and Decentralized Trust As AI spreads, verifying what is real is becoming critical. Governments and companies are turning to blockchain-based digital IDs and decentralized verification systems. The EU is developing a digital identity wallet, while projects like WorldCoin are experimenting with biometric-based IDs. By 2026, Digital identity and decentralized trust frameworks may support everything from financial transactions to AI governance, ensuring authenticity in an increasingly synthetic world. The global digital identity market is projected to surpass $70 billion by 2027. With that kind of growth, digital trust is shaping up to be one of the most important backbones of the next decade. If you made it this far, let us know what you think in the comment section below. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.